Good evening. Welcome to Mercy Secondary School Mount Hawks Virtual Open Night 2021. In the next short while, two of our students, Emma and Cameron, will bring you on a quick tour of the school where you will meet other students who will talk to you about their experiences in music, drama, sport, science and the Student Council. For a fully interactive and more immersive tour, you can check out our school website www.mercymounthawk and on the front page you can click into the virtual tour. On that virtual tour, you will be able to guide yourself around the entire school building and in and out of classrooms and experience the full range of curricular and extracurricular activities that the school has to offer. So, off you go to Emma and Cameron. Um, I think they've gone that way. I heard Aftershock are rehearsing. I know, I'm a huge fan of their music. Let's go take a peek. Oh look, they've already started. The extracurriculars in Mount Hawk has really helped us as a band as we first formed in March 2020 when the TYs organised Battle of the Bands. This has been a really great benefit to us as we're going strong ever since and we've really enjoyed it. As well as being a member of Aftershock, the school also gave me many opportunities such as being chairperson of the TY Fashion Show. This was a great experience and we raised lots of money for St Vincent de Paul. In turn, this led us to being nominated and winning the Garda Youth Award. I'm looking forward to seeing them at the next live concert in school. We're six year students from Mercy Mount Talk and through studying science we were lucky enough to take part in multiple competitions both national and international and develop a product that we are very proud of called Specs. One of my fondest memories of sixth year was working on the Specs project which was a smart glasses system for people with dementia that aimed to help and comfort them when they were faced with paranoia and anxiety caused by not being able to recognise people in their environment. Oh my god, look at these! Hi guys! I got the chance to study sound engineering. I learned how to use sound engineering software and I got the chance to set up a PA for our first centenary session this year and it was great. Last year I was awarded a Garda Youth Achievement Award for charity work that I was delighted to be nominated for by my geography teacher Miss Stella O'Shea. That was so cool. This is so entertaining. So Emma, do you think you're going to do TY? Of course I am. After seeing all the circus skills, the still walking and the drumming, I cannot wait to see what else TY and Mount Talk has to offer and all the amazing opportunities it will open up. What a fantastic choice. Oh look, there's Mr. Rourke. Well, let's go have a chat. Okay lads, you're on the tour. Yeah. How's it going? Yeah, we were just showing everybody all our extracurricular activities around the school. And can I say hello to all the sixth class students and their parents who are joining us this evening for this tour. It was great to meet you during the week. Where are you off to now, lads? The art room, sir. Very good. Okay. Did you know that this here, this wonderful piece of art, was created by one of our past pupils? And it has a very important quote on it. Education is not the filling of a pail, but the lighting of a fire. And that is a really important quotation for us here at Mercy Mount Talk because that is our understanding, our vision of education. We are not just about filling you with information and facts for examinations. No, we want you, each one of you in sixth class who is going to come into us next year, we want you to discover yourself, to find out what fills you with enthusiasm and joy and energy, what brings you to life, what, in the words of the quotation, sets you on fire. And that's the great thing about this school, lads. We have such a range of possibilities for you, for you to discover, to open up, to find out about. Whether that's the coding or the music that you saw earlier, or whether it's the sports and the drama that you're going to visit now in a while, or indeed the art. 
and I want to invite you into our school community to have the opportunity and the chance to learn, to discover, to become the best person you can become. There we go, guys. Off you head to the art room. I'm a senior cycle student here at Mercy Mount Hawk and art has always been a massive part of my life. And I found throughout my six years here at Mercy Mount Hawk that it's been greatly facilitated and I was able to take my artistic abilities to the next level. I did, uh, I did art for junior and senior cycle and I found in my senior cycle life that I've been participating in art competitions and I found that thanks to the school I've been able to be successful at national level in many art competitions. The ability to become deeply involved in a subject such as art within our school is a core part of our school life. Last year, as part of our transition year experience, we took part in Eco UNESCO's Young Environmentalists Awards. Our project was called COVID-19 and we tackled the issue of COVID waste, in particular discouraging the use of disposable masks and providing alternatives. That was so cool! Now we get to go see our favourite part of this whole tour. Our upcoming production of The Importance of Being Earnest. I am afraid I really don't know. The fact is, Lady Bracknell, I said I had lost my parents. It would be near to the truth to say that my parents seem to have lost me. I have been a member of the school choir since first year. Since then, I have taken part in Christmas carol services, choir competitions, and we travelled to Knock twice for the Donal Walsh Memorial Masses. I have also been involved in My Fair Lady and Hairspray, two of the school's musicals. It has been one opportunity after another, and I've had a ball. I don't actually know who I am by birth. I was found. Found? The late Mr. Thomas Cardew, an old gentleman of a very charitable and kindly disposition, found me. Now we we'll go and see our first year student council. I went to Balloonock Primary School. I'm in first year now and I'm on the Wellbeing Committee. I can't wait to get involved in centenary sessions and health promotion week. I am a first year student in Mercy Mount Talk. I went to CBS Primary School and I got elected to, for the Social Integration Committee. I am here to help new students fit in. I attended Blenderville National School. I'm in first year now. I'm on the Environment Committee because I'm passionate about climate change and environmental issues. I'm a first year student from the Salic National School and I'm on the Intercultural Committee. I can't wait to help promote social diversity in our school. I went to Spa National School. I'm on the Wellbeing Committee and I'm excited to help promote health and wellbeing in Mount Hawk. I'm delighted to be on the Wellbeing Committee because it gives students like me an opportunity to have their say in important issues and to bring new ideas and solutions to school life. Hi everyone, my name is Sinead Muldoon Walsh and I'm the Deputy Principal in charge of the first years here in the school. As you can see from the first years you just heard there, they're all settling in really well and getting involved in the different committees and societies that we have here in the school. I can say that we're really looking forward to welcoming you new first years in with us here in September and the first year year head and myself will be on hand to help you in that transition, to help you settle in and to help you as you join us here next year in the tour. That brings us to the end of the tour inside Mount Ox Halls. Now let's pass you over to Emily where she'll talk to you about sports. Hi, I'm a sixth year student in Mercy Mount Hawk and I'm the, currently the captain of the senior ladies team. Um, it's great this year, we have so many girls getting involved. There's enough for three junior teams this year, so it's amazing to get so many girls. Like We used to be struggling to get a junior team, so it's amazing. and The uptake's really improving and I recommend any girl who comes into first year to join because it's so good for making friends. Do you know, I've got friends from first year that I made through football that I still have today. Um, it's a great community in the school um, and everyone's just really close, all through different age groups. It's just great to have the support network like that involved. Um, we got to the Munster Sea uh, Championship uh, Cup uh, two years ago now and it was just all overall an amazing experience. Hi, I'm a fifth year student in Marcy Mount Hawk. Um, I've been playing football since first year. Uh, playing for the school has really helped me achieve my goal of playing for the Kerry Miners. Um, Recently we were on the O'Sullivan Cup Shield and tomorrow we are playing in the Carnivory Munster A competition and it's a great achievement for me and my teammates. I'm a six year student in Marston Talk and I'm captain of the senior football panel this year. 
I think Mount Hawk is a great place for anyone to come, not only for social, but for sports. I mean, the facilities are great. There's great players to play with, you know, playing with different clubs, which you wouldn't get an opportunity anywhere else. And there's great management around the place. It's a really good attitude everywhere. I think, I think playing with Mount Hawk the last six years has helped me come on a load. It helped me make the Kerry Minor panel last year. I started basketball here in first year and we trained and got to an All-Ireland final. We actually won an All-Ireland medal and ever since then we've been working hard to reach the All-Irelands. Our coach trains the National Super League teams and an international team, so his experience is fantastic for us and Mount Hawk. Through training in the mornings um, with the shooting gun, which is the only shooting gun I think in Ireland that a school owns, we managed to make the Irish team under 16 and under 18 and from all this training in school we managed to represent our country at two European Championships and numerous competitions. Soccer is just a great opportunity for young people coming in, boys and girls, to mix with their friends and the people that they haven't met, to, just to get going, keep fit and just, it's great for the mental health as well. Like, and we, we're lucky to have great facilities here such as the gym and the soccer pitch and not much schools have that. I'm a six year student at talk and I play senior soccer. I've been playing soccer the whole way through all the school years and really just gives you a good chance to make friends and learn really what you want to do. There's multiple sports here. And... Well now, we hope you enjoyed that quick tour and meeting some of our students. Remember again to check out the front page of our website for the virtual tour. On the virtual tour, you will be able to guide yourself around the entire school, go in and out of classrooms, and check out the full range of curricular and extracurricular activities that Mercy Mount Hawk has to offer. So, where is it available? www.mercymounthawk.ie I'll let you go back now to Emma and Cameron. Cheerio! That's it from us. We hope you've enjoyed the Mount Hawk experience. Remember to watch our 3D tour on our school website. Bye! Bye.